What is the difference between short and long-term stress in terms of their benefits and their drawback? How should we conceptualize stress? Basically, sort of two graphs that one would draw. The first one is just all sorts of beneficial effects of stress, short term. And then once we get into the chronicity, it's just downhill from there. The sorts of chronic stressors that most people deal with are just undeniably in the chronic range, like having spent the last 20 years, daily traffic jams or abusive boss or some such thing. Um, the other curve that's sort of perpendicular to this is dealing with the fact that sometimes stress is a great thing. Um, like our goal is not to cure people of stress um, because if it's the right kind, we love it. We, we pay good money to be stressed that way by a scary movie or a roller coaster ride. Um, what you wind up seeing is when it's the right amount of stress,